Hey guys, Jessica Damu here with another Survival Hacks review, and today I'm reviewing the Mummy Sleeping Bag. And I got this at a significant discount in exchange for a review. This is the nice, handy package that it comes in. Now this is not a winter Mummy Sleeping Bag. It is more for uh, spring, fall, and summer. Summer might be, uh, you know, if you're up where it's colder. So you don't want this for the winter. They make... Uh, higher grade sleeping bags elsewhere for that but we're gonna give this a nice try I like mummy sleeping bags usually keep you nice and warm and the house is uh, not had a fire for two days so it's a bit nippy downstairs about probably 45 degrees so I took this. a nap in this I thought I would sleep in it overnight but uh, it's not as comfortable as I had hoped the house is about 45 degrees the fire is just been started above my head and uh, I did take a nap in this and it's you know it's a mommy sleeping bag my arms have absolutely nowhere to go kind of feels like being in a straitjacket and being put in the mental ward again did I say again I didn't mean again I meant like you know if that were to happen to me that's what it would feel like that totally never happened anyways <laughs> um I like a mummy sleeping bag. It's it's compact, but at 45 degrees, I'm kind of cold. Like, if I stick my arm out, then my arm's like, ah, I get back in the sleeping bag. But, uh, it'd be nice if there was a, a thicker layer of warmth for the back, just for comfort and to insulate from the ground. Because even though I've got carpet underneath me and a little bit of uh, padding, the concrete, I could feel it coming through to my back and making me a little bit cold. My arms are still cold inside here. You know, at 45 degrees, the sleeping bag is not going to keep you super comfortable. If I'd worn a hoodie while sleeping in it, I think it would have been more comfortable. The top doesn't have any real padding for a pillow, which makes it light for carrying, but I would appreciate a little more multi-purpose. Guess you could fold it around like that. It's not bad, but it's not amazing. Also... Mummy sleeping bags, by their nature, are made for people who like to sleep on their backs and are comfortable sleeping on their backs. And I only probably spend 10% of my time sleeping on my back. The rest I sleep on my side. So, not a good fit for me, but also just not quite warm enough. If you want a summer sleeping bag that's mummy style, this should work. If you want a mummy sleeping bag for the spring and the fall and it gets nippy, find something else. And that's my review. 